What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a dark piano beat from scratch for people like ESTG, Money Baggio, Future, Lil Durk and so on. So the way I started this melody is with this Analog Lab 5 preset called American Jazz Studio and I have laid down this simple piano pattern that sounds like this. For effects I've added an EQ cutting the low end, a Valhalla vintage verb and an echo boy delay. Second thing I've added to this melody was this one shot. I have then reversed it and added these effects, this portal preset, this Valhalla vintage verb, this halftime. After adding the effects this is how the melody came out. Next thing I did is, I duplicated the first piano melody, stretched it to 16 bars and then reversed it and pitched it up one octave. I've then added these effects, an EQ cutting some lows and high end, this portal effect and this S1 imager stereo to make it wider. And this is how it sounds now. Next thing I've added was this bell. I've then added another copy of the same bell, but reversed it. I've added the same Valhalla vintage verb on both the bells, but on the reversed one, I've added this growth speed. I've then played around with the channel volume on the reversed bell, so it will start quieter and get louder as it progresses. You can do this by going down at the velocity tab and switching to channel volume with your mouse wheel. Then you can right click and automate the volume. Now last thing you need to know in order for this to work, you have to make the bell and the reverse bell to cut at the same number. In my case it's 2. Now whenever the bell is playing, the reverse bell stops from playing. This is how you get the reverse bell into the bell sound. Next thing I've added was this texture. With just an EQ for effects. Next sound was this string spiccato up and down from expand, playing this melody. With the only effect being a Valhalla vintage verb. Next I've added the bass. It's the Growler Moog bass from Omnisphere. And for effect, I've added this EQ and two decapitators. One with the beefy preset and one with the dark fat preset. And the last sound I've added was this scream effect to make the loop even more darker. And these are the effects. I've added this portal, this effectrix, Valhalla vintage verb, and this echo boy for a bit of delay and this is how it sounds after all the effects so at this point the loop is pretty much done the next thing i did is i routed all the sounds to a different channel and added rc20 on that channel i have then routed the rc20 channel to another master channel and added these effects this ozone 9 with some excitement and some imager on the mids and high end a Kramer tape studio with this preset, a decapitator adding some distortion and this Fab Filter Pro L to make the loop louder. And this is how the final loop came out. And now let me show you the drums real quick. And this is how the final beat came out. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if this video helped you in some way, shape or form. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.